This video shows how to create a small net of cables with the help of toolbar, path and channel. First of all, we need to specify the type of cable. The diameter of the chosen cable is 3.5 mm. Accordingly, we should raise the plane along which we will pave the path by 1.75 mm, so uh, that our cable would not cross the horizontal details surface. Let's create the lines of the plane along which the cable will pass. We create the lines uh, not only on horizontal surface, uh, also on vertical surface too. Now we use the toolbar channel New Dynamic Pass. In the menu that appears we select the starting point on the plane. Uh, click Start Point, choose the starting point on the plane and then specify next points on the plane. Now we need to create fillets. Uh, for this purpose we use the top 3D fillet on the toolbar cabling modify more. In order to change the path, uh, you need to go to the menu channel, modify, move path point. Select the ending point of the line and then specify the connection point and click OK. To create a cable based on the bus, use the tab manual road on the toolbar channel wire. Then specify the type of cable in the menu. In the start condition, choose connector. Set the order of connector contacts, uh, pins, numbers and indicate the direction of wiring harnesses bending. 
After that, in the section Select Path Edges, define the lines uh, of the path along which the cable will pass. And then uh, do the same operations near the other connectors. To connect the end of the cable with the last connector, we use the tab uh, Move and Point on the toolbar cabling modify. In the menu that appears, select the ending point and raise the end of the cable to the desired height. Then we make the extension of wires from the cable by the function split on the toolbar cabling mode.